Okay, who would like to fir do first contribu contribution? Okay, I don't know if this refers to me well, and my issues with Anna. Each week the housemates have a family dinner to discuss any issues. Tonight, the divide amongst the girls is high on the agenda. I wasn't impressed with Anna with um, her being um, very spiteful over the, um, the oats issue. And um, when you got evicted and spitefulness came into it then, you don't think that's true? <laughs> First off, I'd like to say, bitching behind my back, Crystal, I heard you guys when I was in the bedroom today, so you do. And you guys haven't come up to me once since I've come back in the house to tell me your opinions. You haven't tried to sort anything out. You've just let it go. And why don't you talk about Camilla like that as well? Because she's done exactly the same as me. So whatever with that one. I haven't heard Camilla say that. It's Anything. on, this is revenge, it's on. That's the thing that we were in the revenge room, Karen. No, when you got back. You were, she heard we were in that. a revenge room, that's the whole thing about it. It was revenge. Can, can I just ask something to Camilla? Katie's got the what thing. What did I say when, when Anna was in the room? What did I say? I said I'd like to get to know her. And, I did and I've been telling people that I'd like to get to know real you because I've only ever known the fake you. We all just probably should communicate a little bit more. It's really difficult when you find things out sometimes in a roundabout or a backward way, but I just think we should all be as open as possible with each other. Yeah? Uh, sometimes it is healthy to, not to bitch about people, but to talk about, like, discuss what you think of another person with, with, with someone else, but I don't think it's healthy for you to smear their name or influence your opinion of, some, of someone onto someone else, so. All three of you really need to, and I encourage you talking, guys whatever, to... it's Katie's turn. <laughs> I, I like everyone, and I hope they don't bitch about me. Well. <laughs> <laughs>
We don't have any issues? No, I was just about to say that to you. Yeah. Um, I did put you in the same boat with Karen and Crystal. Crystal. Yeah. Even last night after you did talk to me. Yeah. But I'm taking you out of that boat and putting you on my little sailing. I'd love you to do that. All right. Thanks, Tom. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for doing that. Sorry, I put you in the boat without talking to you. No, no, it's, no, that's okay. Yeah. I could see, I could see, I could see why. And I said this to Camilla that coming out of that, I think I did um, speak too harshly on both of your accounts, and um, and I do regret saying some of the stuff that I did. As I said to Jamie, you just got to live life, no exactly. regrets in the past. Beautiful. Yeah. Thanks, exactly. <laughs> Oh, Gaylo. <laughs> One down, two to go. I'm out of the sin bin with Anna. Oh, uh, did you just get rid of yourself? Oh no, she's like, oh, I must admit today I did put you in the same bin as um, Kristen and um, Karen, but I'm, I've, after today I'm willing to take you out of that because um, I'd really like to get to know you, so I'm just like, awesome. She's that to me too. After her fight with Karen and Crystal, an emotional Anna retreats to the diary room. Anna? I know I shouldn't let it get to me that much, but it's just one person's opinion and I really don't care. I just got so worked up and I'm just so angry and... Who are you angry with? Karen. Crystal, but not as much, I don't really care. And I know I've got at least two weeks and up to 12 weeks with them. It's just so hard. What's so hard? This, feeling like this. You don't have any issues with me? No, I just have an issue with the girls. Okay. It's oh, not with the girls, I just have an issue with girls. Being that us boys, we don't all get along. No. But we don't, the boys in general, we don't, you know, have divides and subgroups and whatever. We all, mm. we can all sit, stick together and I yeah. think it's a shame to see that the girls can't, can't do that. Felt sorry for Anna coming back and f copying it. But you know that she did bring things upon herself as well. And I said that, I said, I don't, I'm not going to apologise. I wasn't. Yeah. And the other thing, I reckon she feels like she's been cornered, so any, any tiny little attack, she'll, she'll bite back at really hard. But I must say, after what she said to me just before, one-on-one -on -one in the bedroom, I am all for her whether you two agree with that or not, but um, I am, I'm I don't think any, I'm, become her friend. I don't think the point is being for or against anyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's not about being yeah. for or against anyone, right or wrong. Neither. No, no, no. It's no, no, just no. Like, making sure that, I mean, if, if you, even if you don't like someone, you still want them yeah. to be happy, oh, especially yeah. if you're going to see them every day. Yeah. And I just tried to do that with her, though, and now she's just like, yeah, she didn't want to do it with her. She's putting up, no way. really defensive She's putting up her defences now, so... It's just so stressful to have these people just sit there and just treat me like dirt. They're both sitting there together, mum and daughter. I'm going to gang up in you right now and I'm going to tell you what you've done wrong. In. That's their problem though. That's an insecurity on someone else. That. Yeah, absolutely. Don't let it get to you. Let, I don't let, let it get to me. I'm just like, I, I'm the stronger person but I don't do anything back in tonight. I just shouldn't have fought back, but no, I did. No, you, I thought that was good. You were strong. Yeah, yeah no, good work. I, don't I think you should do got definitely to take it in your stride, though, because the only reason someone deems necessary to maybe gang up on someone is to bring someone down. So they look at you as a high person. Right? Um, Australia's national pastime is tall puppy syndrome. <laughs> <laughs>